Hey y'all, it's Stella and today we are going to be doing a Good American Jean try on haul. Now these are the Always Fits jeans from Good American. We're about to put the Good American Always Fits jeans to the ultimate test. I'm a size 14. I'm a size 16. And I'm a size 18. And these are a size 14 through 18. So will they fit all three of us? I'll go first. Oh, they look really good. Right? It's the only pair of skinny jeans I've kept. Your turn. Yes. Wow. Yes. They cut the booty. Okay. I feel it. I believe it's not. Like the good American always fits jeans approved. They have gone incredibly viral on my TikTok because there's a debate around them. So the whole idea of these jeans is that it fits with you between any four sizes. These are to fit anyone a size 20 to 26. I'm a size 18, sometimes a size 20 at Good American. So I'm in this weird in-between stage because the other options are the 14 to 18. Now I prefer, personal preference, I preferred the 14 to 18 just because it seemed to lift my butt a little bit. These fit really well and they're nice. What I seem to read in all the comments is that there's just a preference on how someone with my stomach and someone with my body shape should be wearing jeans. I firmly believe that if I had a flat stomach and I was a size 18 with just butt, there wouldn't be that much of a debate. Today, I'm just gonna show you the size 20 to 26. Let's get into it. These jeans are pretty pricey, not gonna hold you. These jeans are pretty pricey, I'm not gonna hold you. They are definitely an investment. They're definitely around the 150 range and I do think you can find good jeans that are in a way more affordable range. Probably gonna be in the fast fashion market and these are not so that's something I want you guys to keep in mind if you're looking for more sustainable pieces you're probably gonna have to jump into that mid-tier price point which these are good American is not the only brand pricing jeans like this mid-tier market the jeans are probably around 199 Harrison but comparison is the FIFA joy so I'm excited to show you some of these jeans I like them because my weight does fluctuate on one hand it gives me security that, like the jeans will fit with me but then on the other hand like I just told you I'm in between the 18 and the 20 so what pair do I get a good problem solving to this would be having like a 16 to a 22 range. That way, if you are in that weird middle range, you would be able to confidently pick what size you should wear. And before I can hear the comments now, before you ask where the dress I'm wearing is from, it's from the thrift store and it's from a brand I've never heard about. Rabbit, rabbit, rabbit. I've never heard of that brand. So I probably, I'll look for it online. If I don't find it, you'll know why. But I just want to mention that because usually when I wear things that are not part of the haul, people ask and I just don't know. Without further ado, let's get into this haul. Okay, so this first jean we're gonna put on, I'm gonna read the style because they all look the same and I just wanna make sure. So the style is GLAF 478T for these. These are the Always Fits Good Legs Straight in Indigo 316. I'm saying that because I just had issues with people finding the jeans. I wore these jeans before and someone said I didn't give them the right name, but I did. So I just want to clear it now. I read it off the tag. Everyone's clear. So these I really, really like wearing my granny panties. I've been really into granny panties lately. Like these are from Lovelet. They're just very comfy. So whatever. Lovelet and Skims has all my money when it comes to underwear. These are a really comfortable fit as you saw how great it was to put them on. As a size 18 wearing these jeans, although they may look better on the Apple Check this out. You're gonna have gapping. With the 14, 18, I didn't. But I'm saying this to say, be weary if you're on that weird line because would you rather deal with them being a little tight or having this weird gapping? Just depending on where you are with your body, how your body fluctuates, I just want you to keep that in mind. Uh, but they're nice. They're really nice jeans. And this is why I like mid-range jeans. They feel better. Like fast fashion jeans, I feel they're good. They serve a purpose and they last. But I feel like a, the weight and the feel and the structure and the construction of a mid-range jean it's pretty awesome. So these are nice. These are a great everyday jean. I love them. My apple isn't poking out too much and it's fun, but <laughs> tugging a little bit, but that's okay. I just want to show you the front, the styling. I love that they are appropriate for my ankles. I think Good American just dropped a petite line too. That's something that they've been asking the brand forever. It's like, when are you guys dropping petite? When are you dropping petite? Let's show you the backside. Now the butt's cute. I have a preference, but you guys know, so I'll let it go. Um, but yeah, it looks good, it fits well. So here are these Indigo 316s. All right, let's move on to the next pair. I have not worn this exact pair in this size yet. These are the good classic. Style is GCLA F478T in Indigo. Four, four, six. These are some of my favorite everyday jeans. I do wear, not this exact pair, but I do wear them. Honestly, my friend's gonna get so lucky because she's a size 26, I think. And she's like, I wanted to try the jeans. And I was like, well, I got three extra ones. These were gifted for a campaign I did, but this is not a sponsored video literally at all. Like, I don't even know if they'll ever see this. So this is just us trying on jeans together. 
But I was like, well, they sent me three. They, I ordered them in the wrong size, so do you want them? So she's gonna get all these jeans for free. And I'm like, that is such a come up. You just gotta be in the right place at the right time, know the right people. But I'm actually obsessed with these jeans. Now they do have a frayed ankle, but they're very cute and so comfortable. I actually like the fit of these better than the indigos I just showed you. And maybe that's because I've worn the indigos before. Again, I have obviously tags. I haven't worn these yet. There is a little bit of a gapping in the back as well, but I'm wondering if the other jeans were fitting like this before I maybe wore those out for the day. So these jeans are great. Um, the color is really beautiful. You can get them in long and petite, very nice. Not much else to say other than I like them. So let me go ahead and show you. All right, let's move on to our last pair. Before I show you too much of these jeans, one thing about the Always Fit is that they do sell out. So if at the time of me making this video, if they are sold out, sign up for the mailing list because when I posted these on TikTok, that was the number one comment. Like, why would they give you these jeans? They're always sold out, they're always sold out. And people really can't get their hands on them. I'm not saying like, oh, go run out and get them. Not what I'm saying at all. But if they are, if you're kind of eyeing them or saving up for them or, you know, want to after pay them and you're like, I like them, I want them, just letting you know, sign up for the emails because Apparently these run out very, very quickly. All right, this last pair, this is probably the most plasticky feeling eco-plastic I've ever used or felt, ever. That's very interesting. Like it feels like the normal plastic, but I had to make sure it's recyclable. That's cool. All right, so next, this is a really pretty pair. Um, this I would consider like a business sheen. I would wear this, like if I had an office shop, I would definitely wear this to an office shop. They're very clean, no frays, no rips. Um, a solid jean. So these are the Always Fits Good Legs Denith, Denethic, I can't say it, Denethic Blue 4, number four, um, in the style GL478T. It's cute, let's obviously y'all saw me rip me out the plastic wrap, acting brand new. So the funny thing about me not listening to secular music anymore is I don't know these songs outside of TikTok. I couldn't tell you who sings ripping off the plastic, but every time I rip open plastic, I think about ripping off the plastic, acting brand new. So, whoa. There's one leg. These are really, really nice. These feel a little longer than the other two I showed you, which is important because they're all regular length. So if you are on the shorter side wearing jeans, I would get these in petite because at the ankle, they seem to be bunched up a little bit more and they're not as short as the other pair that we wore before, which depending on your height could work for you or work against you. So making sure to let you know. I again think these jeans are just very clean. They give a very clean and polished look. I have these in my size as well. A straight edge cut that looks great and like thigh highs and just looks sexy and form fitting. I feel like with this sizing, I'm cool with it. It just is giving more like comfy opposed to I'm showing up to stunt, so. If you're in that in-betweeny, that's what you gotta look forward to, but these are really cool. These are definitely a good classic jean that I know in a professional setting, I'd be really, really happy with them. So here they are. So just for fun and for reference, I'm gonna show you guys me in the 1418s and you can decide which one you think would look better on you if you're using this video as a reference for your Good American Always Fits jeans. Will these size 14 Good American jeans fit me as a size 18? Apparently so. I ordered the Always Fit jeans online, but I ordered them a size up and I instantly regretted it. Once I pair these with a good pair of shapewear, we're in there like swimwear. I'm pretty excited these jeans will stay the same as I change. These are a really smart investment them in the 20 to 26 so these are the always fit jeans from good american which i had ordered in a 20 to size 26 but i am a size 18 i instantly regretted it i said this is gonna be too big here goes nothing the body dysmorphia is so bad these jeans These jeans are so big on me. They're so big. Good American jeans are definitely true to size. I'm not a size 20 in their jeans. Never. But guys, did y'all see how good my butt looked in the last one? My butt looks good in these, but you can see all this baggy fabric underneath. No, definitely a 14 to 18 and always fit jeans. And it's so weird to my brain. I like can't comprehend that. Trying the Good American Always Fits jeans was the best thing I could have ever done. This technology is so innovative with a one size fits four technology. Simply unheard of. 
I love everything about the fit and quality of them. Mainly my favorite part is how my butt looks in them. Don't miss out on finding your fit with the Good American Always Fits jeans. Thank you guys so much for watching this Good American Jean try on haul. Which one were your favorites? I will list all the jeans down below in the order that I wore them. And don't forget about our Bali trip. If you're interested in coming to Bali with us, the links for that will be down below. Can you see yourself trying GA? Are you gonna pass on it? Let me know. See you guys really, really soon. Love and light. Bye-bye.